crazy dream. I turned on a classic movie after Raw ended, and when I fell asleep, my brain was a whirlwind of wicked witches, scarecrows, and tin men fighting all my favorite WWE superstars. Got me thinking about tornado tag team matches. Any chance you'd click your heels and make all my dreams come true? <laughs> Better get ready. The following contest is a tornado tag team match. On the way to the ring, Sweetness, Miss Jackson, and Carmella. This former indie competitor overcame injuries, disappointing losses, and self-doubt to earn an invite to the WWE Performance Center. To see footage of where she started to her ability now as a WWE superstar is just unbelievable. Well, she was once one of the sweetest. She's now one of the meanest. And their opponents first from San Jose, California. Hey, despite what you think about Bailey, there's no denying what she's accomplished. The first Grand Slam champion in the women's division. And there's also no denying that Bailey has no problem stepping on anyone along the way. It's because Bailey thanks herself for all of her accomplishments. And you can't argue with the results. Bailey knows how to win. Grown tired of being an underdog. She's tired of being overlooked. Has toppled every foe that stood in her way. Here comes the queen, the franchise, and the self-proclaimed Opportunity. And from the Queen City, Charlotte Flair. You know, the WWE Universe, at least many in it, believe that she's been handed title opportunities in main events. Well, many of those same doubters live in their parents' basements, Cole. I wouldn't necessarily value their opinion. This is Charlotte Flair. This is the Queen. This is the opportunity. So, Byron, from your parents' basement, what do you feel about Charlotte Flair? First of all, I moved out last week, Michael. And second of all, I do think Charlotte's ego can be a bit out of control at times. After everything Charlotte Flair has accomplished in her career, her ego is allowed to be as big as it possibly can be. got an amazing robe. Saxon, how have you not learned by now? You need to open the ropes for the queen. Corey, haven't you heard? I'm no longer on robe duty. Oh, I didn't get that memo.
And here we go in this no disqualification match. Nothing is off limits here. This is the perfect setting for a superstar to fight without any regard for the rule book, and more importantly, any regard for their opponent. Well scouted by Charlotte. Oh, she lands hard. She probably knew that camera wouldn't do. Set it up. Oh, and the Giving the people a chance to take in her undeniable greatness. Enough already. Oh, that was just malicious. Assaulted. Systematic attack on that arm. Queen. Ooh, well planted knee. Ouch. Right across the knee. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. Oh my god. Pendulum back pressure. Tick tock. Shot over the steel floor. In control here with a swinging neck. And she goes for the pin. Raises the shoulder before the one count. Doesn't go well if you still can't get more than a one count by now. Impact star! Tremendous pressure on that neck. There's a supreme woman in our midst. Show some respect, WWE Universe. Bailey sent flying. Taking it outside the ring now. Oh, look at that. Embracing her adoring public. Ow! Stop to the leg. And they're continuing to punish their opponent with a German. Oh, the face has been planted.
This team was totally in sync, attacking in perfect unison like they were reading each other's minds. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Newark, New Jersey, Sweetness, Miss Jackson. This superstar credits her time on the Indies as a major factor in her success in WWE. Indie experience aside, it didn't hurt to have Booker T, Shawn Michaels, and Beth Phoenix's help along the way. The irresistible force is on Raw. And from San Diego, California, Nia Jax. Hey, whenever Nia Jax enters an arena, whenever Nia Jax enters a match, everyone takes notice of the dominance that this woman is capable of. She's beautiful, she's powerful, she's dangerous. It's like a million dollar smile on a wrecking ball. Nia Jax is the irresistible force to be reckoned with. It is absolutely impossible to plan against an opponent the size of Nia Jax. Nia Jax looks to be in a bad mood, and I'm pretty sure she's going to take it out on her opponent. Nia Jax in the ring, the powerhouse of the women's division. Nia absolutely loves to impose her will over her peers here in WWE. Cole, I think you mean she loves to impose her will over the competition. She's looking at it early. 
Uh, she's able to kick out before the refs count. She's trying to drain some energy with that early cover. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Put down face first. This could be it. Bonsai drop. Escape just in time. There she goes. She's got to be careful here. The referee will count her out. Didn't go to plan for Jax. Sweet rolling Savon kick. Coming back in the ring. That'll turn your lights out. Nia's getting picked apart here. Nia needs to find that irresistible force once more. That offense taking a toll on her.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Newark, New Jersey, Sweetness, Miss Jackson. This former indie star first appeared on WWE's radar after she won the Most Improved Wrestler Award at Booker T's Training School. Her dedication went next level at the Performance Center. She says she's here to kick the women's evolution up a notch and ride that straight to the top. Irresistible force. And from San Diego, California, Nia Jax. Jax has ruled the women's division right, since it. day one. She's held singles and tag team titles here in WWE and still wants more. Nia Jax straight up runs things in the women's division. Going to impose her will on anyone in that ring tonight. Nia Jax's opponent may be coming into tonight's rematch with momentum after a big win, but Nia is fighting with some extra fuel of her own. She's fighting for her family. Nia is also fighting to make sure The Rock doesn't bury her on social media again. Ouch. There's no doubt Nia's got the weight of the world on her, but both superstars are definitely competing under some extra pressure. There's a cover. She kicks out with authority. She is still very much in this. Turn Nia Jax around there. Sweet rolling savat kick. What does she have planned for Jax? Forearm smash. Ooh, well measured. Got to find a way to get out of this. Go right to the throat. Great counter. Drop kick. Beautiful. Check out this power, ladies and gentlemen. Up this. and. She adjusts it and reverses it. Able to get the advantage here. Right to the kidneys from behind. Bad predicament right here. Oh, snake eyes. Katie in their face. Ooh, what a forearm club. Ooh. Oh, this is going to hurt. Stop right to the belly. Big impact. Nia Jax brushes that one off. Ooh, she just turned it around. Basement drop kick. Nia saw it coming. And is Nia going for it? She is. One of her cousin's signature moves, the rock bottom. This has to be the end of this match. Apparently, Nia's not done yet. What is she trying to prove here? She just put her hands on the referee. That's an automatic disqualification. I don't think her mindset's on winning the match anymore. Nia Jax is clearly trying to prove a point. And with that rock bottom, it seems very clear who she's trying to prove herself to. How much more punishment can her opponent take? All for Nia Jax's delicate ego? She's... And no, not... No, don't do it, Nia. Come on! Someone dropped to the floor. Guys, she might be badly injured.
Well, one thing's for certain, that message Nia Jax sent tonight was heard loud and clear and won't be forgotten anytime soon. Glad to see you up and around. We've been worried about you. Up and around, but still sore and bruised. I gotta be real. Naya did a number on me. This sounds cliche, especially coming from me. But it looks like maybe you've lost your smile. Happens to the best of us. There's no getting around it. It was a vicious attack. That kind of thing can take a toll, both physically and mentally. Well, like I said, I still have a long way to go before I'm fully clear. And it seems like when I am, Naya's not going to back down. I think you're right about Naya. You're going to have to be ready to face her again, and that's going to take a lot of work. So looks like you have a big decision ahead of you. I know what it's like firsthand to have to recover and train to get back in the game. And I watched Edge go through it, too. And I also know what it's like to walk away, so I totally respect that choice, too. Sometimes it's best to step back for a bit before coming back stronger than ever. So with all that being said, how are you feeling? Do you want to train to face Nye again? Take a step back and walk away from the fight for a bit. I'm not going to let Nia Jax dictate the terms of my career. I need to step away and recover on my own timeline, not hers. I'll reinvent myself on a different brand and come back stronger than ever. Are you sure about this? I'm sure. This is the right decision for me. I appreciate all your support, both of you. All right. Good luck, wherever you end up. I know where I want to go. I'm headed for NXT. See the newest addition to NXT's roster making their way into the arena. If you ask me, I think she's going to do big things here. Well, nobody asked you, but I have to agree. She is the definition of superstar.
Wow. I saw all that drama on social media. Dakota's accusations are crazy. I know, right? I can't believe you said all those things. What? I didn't. Fanny, come on, you know me. Are you really going to trust Dakota's word over mine? Of course not, but when I told Dakota that, she looked me dead in the eyes and said, it's totally true, and she was serious in a way that I was really not prepared for, and it scared me a little bit, and now I'm thinking that, yes, I do believe her over you. I'm very disappointed. Seriously? After all we've been through? You know what? I've been so annoyed by this whole situation that I really need to blow off some steam in the ring. And since Dakota is dodging me, I think it should be you. So how about we see if I can change your mind that way? Do you ever step back and think about how odd it is that this is the only way we choose to settle our differences? Me neither. Let's do it! is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Newark, New Jersey, Sweetness, Miss Jackson. When this competitor was on the indie scene, there was something about her in-ring style that caught the eye of opponents and fans alike. Well, we heard about that style during her time with Booker T, who helped her level up by getting her foot in the door at the Performance Center. She's got more energy than the sun. It's Meili Fan. And from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Meili Fanny Fan. Gentlemen, I think this one's gonna turn into a fight in a hurry and I cannot wait. Determination in her eyes. She is more than ready for competition. Hunter is on the line tonight as May Lee Fan takes on the superstar at the center of a controversy involving alleged harsh words for some of WWE's most revered legends. And let's not forget Dakota Kai's crucial role in stepping up here to reveal the unforgivable disrespect in the first place. Well, Fanny's standing up for Triple H and NXT's iconic trainers, but has anyone stopped to wonder what if Fanny's opponent didn't actually say the things she's been accused of saying? Oh, right in the face. Uh-oh, half and half suplex 
Lights out. She's beginning to flag a little. Suplex brings them down. Producing consecutive attacks. This is frightening strength here. Oh, look at this. German suplex. And not bad yet. Another German. And continuing to punish their opponent with a German. Repeated displays of power are painting an ugly picture here. Drop kick hits the mark. Stomping. Ouch. Seated drop kick connects. All right, snapping her back to reality. This isn't a pose off. Sweet rolling savant kick. Pull that kick. Nasty. Ah, <laughs> oh. oh, snap bear. Oh. May Lee doesn't look like she has any fight left in her. Smooth transition gets to the ropes, and that's going to cause the ref to break the hold. Oh, man. A oh, sling blade. Followed up with a, and a basement drop kick. She's going for it. This could be. Seemed like a pretty easy day at the office right there. As always, Cole, you're more polite than I am, so I'll just say what we're all thinking. This was as one-sided as it gets. Dakota, you've made some pretty serious allegations recently on social media. Because she's making some pretty serious comments, and they need to be addressed. She said, and I quote, the PC was a breeding ground for mediocrity, and I'm embarrassed I had anything to do with that place. Awful. Do you know how many amazing superstars, me included, owe their careers to that place? Normally, I don't spread rumors, but I don't like hearing someone make disparaging comments about a place and the people there who are so important to me. Well, I guess at this point, it's your word against hers. No, it's not. Everyone saw what Finn Balor posted. He can back me up on all of this. I'm just glad she's finally getting exposed for the deceitful, two-faced liar she is. Thank you, Dakota, for uh, clearing that up.
There you see Dakota Kai, who just doubled down further on her recent controversial claims. Wait, from behind, the time for rumor and innuendo is over. In the backstage area just might get ripped apart. I wouldn't be surprised if they wipe out everything in sight. <laughs> you can say goodbye to any equipment back there. Oh, and she turns it around. Sweet rolling savant kick. Nothing fancy here. Backbreaker. I'm backbreaker. Looks like setting up for a suplex. We're gonna finish things off. Boom. Wow! Ooh, treading all over their opponent. And that prevents any offense from Dakota. Insane. Where are these two superstars going to go next? With these two, it looks like nowhere is off limits. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Dakota dodges. Way to steer clear. Sweet rolling savat kick. Cut. Big right hand. Oh, my Lord. Ooh, connects to the back of the neck. She's got them. And that will do it.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Newark, New Jersey, Sweetness, Miss Jackson. From the moment she saw Eddie Guerrero clash with Rey Mysterio at WrestleMania, her life changed. She knew this is what she wanted to do with her life. That match provided the spark that lit the flame for her career and was the catalyst in shaping the superstar we see today. Here comes Trouble, a superstar who is always ready for a fight. And she won't let anything stand in her way. And from Auckland, New Zealand, Dakota Kai! This is a woman who demands her place in the spotlight and has taken it by pure force. It's hard to think at one time Dakota Kai was the captain of Team yeah, at one which, time, Byron, at one time. That included the entire WWE Universe, but how things have changed. Dakota is no longer the captain of Team Kick. She's the leader and the ruler of Team Kick. And Saxton, you're off. Tonight, Dakota Kai is defending her honor against a superstar who appears to be spinning further and further out of control. Well, Dakota Kai's opponent has been accused of saying some pretty reprehensible stuff. I'll give you that, but where's the proof, Corey? It's all she said, she said. That may be the case, but the time for talking has ended as Dakota Kai and her opponent look to settle their issues in the ring. Oh, solid form. right back on Kai. Able to reverse. Oh, that hurt right in the kidney. Golly. Side headlock applied. Oh, good treasure. Assaulting the knee with purpose. Oh, she could do it here. Lock. No, no! Belly to belly! My goodness! Oh, look at this! German suplex! And not done yet! Another German! And continuing to punish their opponent with a German! She scores big with the counter! She saw it coming! Sight here. Oh, no. Someone call the orthodontist. Gun suplex. Making it look easy. She's forced onto the defensive now. Dakota wards off the attack. Oh, and that got some time. Seems unable to turn the momentum here. Kai's having trouble getting her bearings. Turning the tables. Could be the tide turn Dakota desperately needed. Hits the drop kick.
Oh. Scary pattern starting to form as that upper area takes more damage. Sends into the corner. Oh, she counters right back on Kai. Oof. And now she finds herself only playing defense. She's efficient and dangerous. Sweet rolling Zavok kick. Smooth transition. Rolling into the knee bar. You feel like hope is starting to... It's over. She couldn't hang on. And you can put their singles match in the books. Here is your winner, Sweetness. Miss Jackson. She has plenty to celebrate here tonight. The entire women's division was watching this one, and she is the one to watch, guys. So, you've been busy. And you haven't. I need you to step in and stop all this social media back and forth. Normally stuff like this wouldn't bother me, but she's going after my reputation. Finn, too. And then I beat her, and that still didn't shut her up. What more can I do? Nothing. It's a she said, she said situation. And it's hard to know whose side to take. It's not very hard. Take mine. The one who isn't lying. For all I know, you might have been lying when you said that. It's quite a conundrum. Luckily, I've come up with a magnificent and unprecedented solution. The two of you will face off in a no disqualification match. Whomever loses will then be immediately hooked up to a lie detector machine. Then we'll have definitive proof of who has been forthright and who has not. This is unbelievable. It is, but after this, one of you will be believable. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Newark, New Jersey, Sweetness, Miss Jackson. This former indie star was part of tag teams and formed some strong bonds before WWE. After training with Booker T, she learned the most important thing to focus on is herself. For her, business is business, and whoever steps in her way, is going down.
Gentlemen, are you ready? I think Dakota Kai is about to get her kicks. I see what you did there. Look at that intimidating scowl. Byron, you look scared. I am scared. And from Auckland, New Zealand, Dakota Kai. Ruthless attitude and ruthless kicks. Half of the first ever NXT Women's Tag Team Champions. You know, it's hard to think at one time, Dakota Kai was the captain of Team yeah, at one time, Byron, at one time. That included the entire WWE Universe, but how things have changed. Dakota is no longer the captain of Team Kick. She's the leader and the ruler of Team Kick. And Saxton, you're off. It's all going to this. Dakota Kai and the woman accused of disrespecting WWE's most iconic figures are squaring off in an ODQ match with a lie detector test awaiting the loser. Finally, the truth is around the corner. You can't handle the truth, Saxton. Well, I have a feeling Dakota Kai is the one who can't handle the truth, Corey. Bang it back with their own cover. Out of the way in time. And that prevents any offense from Dakota. Lights up! Oh, look at this! German suplex! And not done yet! Another German! And continuing to punish their opponent with a German! He turns it right around with a counter! Saw that one coming! Took advantage! Plenty of hits coming her way now. Ooh, treading all over their opponent. Big form. And now Dakota is feeling heavy pressure. Kyle might be feeling a bit rattled. That can't stop you in your tracks.
I can't believe this is actually happening, but at least we're finally going to get some answers. I don't understand why I have to do this. This is humiliating. I'm not the one who spent the last few weeks smearing everyone I've ever met, including legends who've helped me get here. No, you're the one who lied about it. Ladies, please. The truth will be revealed in due time. Now, Dakota, let's begin with some warm-up questions to calibrate our readings. Should be an easy one here. What is your name? Dakota Kai. That is a true statement. OK, where were you born? Auckland. Can I go now? Another true statement. And uh, no, not yet. Next one. Do you think I'm a good GM? Uh, yes. You've wounded my feelings, but at least we know the machine is properly calibrated. Now, let's get to why we're really here. When you said you overheard your opponent tonight saying the PC is a breeding ground for mediocrity, was that the truth? Yes. Lie. I'm telling the truth. That's also a lie. That machine is faulty. Another lie. I told you, this proves everything. Fine. I made it all up. And then I convinced Finn to lie too. You happy? Is that what you want to hear? Yes. That was the whole point of all of this. She's right. You were in my way and I didn't know what else to do. I deserve all the same opportunities they've given you. Turn that thing off. Yeah, give it a break. I want what you've got. And I'm going to use everything I can to get it. So I took my shot. Maybe this time I went too far. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I should have handled things in the ring rather than making up all those lies and rumors. I hope you can someday forgive me. But for now, how about a truce? I don't know about this. Dakota Kai with a cheap shot. This woman has absolutely no dignity. I think we got official confirmation of that here tonight. Hey, maybe they should have left the lie detector on a little longer. Could have prevented Dakota's opponent from getting smacked in the face. Something tells me this still isn't over between these two. Oil meets water. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring. Sweetness, Miss Jackson, and the game, Triple H. They call it mixed tag for a reason. Very different personalities in the ring. Yeah, it is never too late to learn something new, and I hope she realizes that.
Gentlemen, are you ready? I think Dakota Kai is about to get her kicks. I see what you did there. Look at that intimidating scowl. Byron, you look scared. I am scared. And from Auckland, New Zealand, Dakota Kai. This is a woman who demands her place in the spotlight and has taken it by pure force. You know, it's hard to think at one time Dakota Kai was the captain of Team yeah, at one which, time, Byron, at one time. That included the entire WWE Universe, but how things have changed. Dakota is no longer the captain of Team Kick. She's the leader and the ruler of Team Kick. And Saxton, you're off. The Prince has arrived. A decorated champion who has truly reinvented himself. And from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, Finn Balor! This is a man who is already one of the greatest NXT superstars in history but truly cemented his legacy by returning and dominating as NXT champion once again. Well, now he's set to dominate any roster that Finn Balor targets. You know, I don't know if it's just me, or does Finn Balor just keep getting cooler every year? Saxton, when it comes to being cool, you are one man I will never ask. You can see the intense focus and drive in the eyes of Finn Balor. When it comes to Finn Balor, it's always about competing at the highest of levels. Buckle up, folks, because we're in store for an explosive climax to a saga that has reached all the way to the very top of NXT. What a night. A legend among legends has joined the recently exonerated NXT superstar to make Finn Balor and Nikola Kai pay for their despicable lives. It's not every night a Hall of Famer laces up his boots and gets into the ring, so this is a special treat for WWE fans all around the world. Unless, of course, you're a fan of Dakota Kai or Finn Balor, in which case, you're probably in for a long night. Hitting the elbow drop. Oh. Well measured. Kai out of there in a hurry. <laughs> Real European uppercut. Things taking a turn for her now. Oh, look at this. German suplex. And not done yet. Another German. And continuing. Able to sidestep it. Each superstar trying to stay a step ahead. Ooh, well planted knee. Ouch. Dakota seems unable to turn the momentum here. Kai might be feeling a bit rattled. She got launched. These guys have been looking to beat each other up for a while, and now it's their chance. Get him in. 
into the corner. Punch right to the face. She's taking it, starting to pile up. Ooh, stinging kick. What's he got in mind? He saw it coming, taking advantage. And Balor's attack gets cut off. there. Right to the kidneys from behind. Great wherewithal on the counter. Close lines. Good Lord. So effective. This the dog snap super so quick. Responds with a counter of their own. Tagged with a punch. Boom! Yeah. A forearm smack. He counters. Close line. Oh, so effective. Oh. Hits him with the counter. There's the sling blade. And a basement drop kick. Over the checker's nose. And Finn Balor is really taking a pounding. I don't know how much more Finn Balor has left. Might want to walk it off or shake it off. Both arms hooked. <laughs> Triple H has this all sewn up. He still has some gas left in the tank. Finds the advantage after a string of counters. What a shot. Overhead kick finds the mark. Fantastic jumping spinning heel kick. Superstar showing great awareness of their opponent's repertoire. Solid punch. Well, that's one way to leave the ring, I suppose. to switch with his partner, too. A oh, sling blade. Followed up with a basement drop kick. Shoulders down. Could she finally put this away? Two. And a kick out of two. This 
this is no time to hesitate. You can feel the end coming. Ooh, well planted knee. Ouch. Kai's bordering on the loss. We could be close to an end. Dakota wards off the attack. So Sam recover. Is it enough? And she kicks out right away. She is still in this fight. Over and over again. Oh, that was creative. Packing drop kick. Drops the hammer. Right on the lower back. Oh, I didn't go as planned there. Oh, right to the kidneys. Looking bad for her here. Stick. Here it comes!
Jackson and the game, Triple H. Quite the next tag team win here for this guy and gal. Chemistry on point. Teamwork looking sharp. For my money, this